Hi, I'm Rachel Tapman, a data scientist here at Kaggle, and today I'm going to show you five ways to add data sets to your Kaggle kernel or notebook so that you can use them in your work. So here is a new notebook, I've called it No Data Added, and if I look under the inputs here, you can see I don't have any data sets. So how do I get my data sets into my notebook? Five ways. The first way is to upload a data set, and all of these ways are going to be under this plus add data button over here. So I can upload a data set by uh, clicking here on Upload. I can select files from my local computer. I can uh, create a data set from a link to a URL. Uh, for example, if I had a CSV hosted somewhere that was publicly available. I can import a GitHub repository. This can be helpful if you are um, analyzing code. And I can create a new data set from the output files of another kernel or notebook. So if I have um, written a notebook previously, I've saved some files in it, I can create a new data set using those files and then add them to my current notebook. So the first way is to create a data set. The second way is to uh, search for data sets that are already on the site. So here, for example, I have uh, some of the data sets that are very popular right now. I have this, um, I noticed this top 50 Spotify songs data set. I might be interested in other music data sets. So I've clicked on the music tag here and I filtered by the tag music. Uh, and that gets me other music related data sets. Uh, and I could also search. Uh, by uh, by tag or by title. So here I'm searching for music and I'm being returned data sets about music. So the second way is to search for data sets that are already on the site. Uh, the third way is to uh, have a data set on the site you know you want to use and then add it by the URL. So I have another data set over here, this uh, waves measuring boys data, which is public data from Queensland in Australia. So I can copy this URL, uh, paste it here, uh, and when I search, I could, should get the exact data set that I'm looking for out. Uh, and this is helpful if you're looking for a data set where there's a lot of data sets that have similar titles. So the third way is to search by URL. The fourth way is to add competition data. So um, if you um, sign up for a competition and you've accepted the rules, you can add the data to a notebook on kernel. Uh, and if you try to add data and you haven't accepted the rules yet, you'll be prompted to do so. Uh, that's the fourth way. And the fifth way is to uh, add data files directly from the outputs of a different kernel or a different notebook. Um, so here are uh, public notebooks that have popular files. Uh, I can also search for just notebooks that I've written. Uh, and you can see here are a number of uh, notebooks and kernels that have different file outputs. So I could select one of these and then add it to my uh, current notebook and be able to use the files I've created there. So those are the five ways, uploading a data set, uh, searching using this browser, finding it via the URL, uploading a, uh, using a competition data set, or uh, using data that has been created as a file output from another notebook. So I hope you find this useful and it helps you in your work on Kaggle. Thanks for joining me and I'll see you on Kaggle. Bye.